Hey guys, how's it going? It's Brandon here, BB's iPod Touch Up. And today I got a uh, little city of tweak for you guys it's called Alert Artist. It's a pretty cool uh, little tweak. So let me just go ahead and show you what it's all about. So let's just, uh, here's a good way of doing it. I'll just put in a false email address so it gives me a little pop up. So here we go. And you see that it's like blue with a green outline. It's like a lime green outline on a blue um, background with red text and a different kind of text. So this app basically lets you change your text, your colors, and everything. Uh, it's just a full artist. So what you can do to get to this, it's not going to be in your settings. It's actually going to be an app like a uh, icon on your springboard. So it's going to look like that right there. See where it says hi, alert artist. Click on that. And it'll give you a test right there. You can see test. So that's going to be what it looks like once you change this stuff up. Uh, you can do live tests and stuff. So this is pretty cool. So modify back. We have modify background color, modify border color. We have all these different things we can modify. So let's say we wanted to see. I have it on all blue. It is limited. You can't do like any color. You have red, green, blue, and you can make different colors if you like add them in. Um, see that? It's like a light blue. I can add some red in. Makes it like a almost a purple. There you go. There's like a purple color. Uh, there's like an orange color. So you can just like mess around with them and make all types of different colors. So you can see that one there. It's kind of like a, a dark, dark brown. I mean, dark, dark orange, almost a brown. So I'm just going to stick with that. Uh, border color. We can just make the border color. Uh, let's make it red. Let's make it completely red. Oops. Okay. So there we go. It's red. And actually, I'm going to add some blue. There we go. Actually, it's like pink. I don't know. That's that's weird looking. All right, it's like purple actually on the background. So let's just keep that purple. Shadow color. Uh, you see the little shadow under there, blue. Um, I don't usually mess with this that much, but there you go. You can see it's like a little blue shadow under there. Uh, text color. We could change the text to a blue. There we go. So we got blue text now. Oops. We got blue text. So let's go ahead and change the last thing, which is the text shadow color. I'm going to make this blue as well so it just looks like it's just blue and no nothing else special. So there we go, we have that. Now we can change the title font and the body font. So the title font is just where it says test. You can change that to, there's that kind of font. Um, and let's change the body font to random. There you go, there's that one. And you can change the size and everything over here. So there you go, that's a big old thing right there. So there you go, you see it. And then you can change, uh, you can make themes. This, these are just preset ones. You could choose between preset ones too if you want. So let's go back and we can hit done right up here on the top right. You need to, here you go, it says you need to restart your spring board for changes to take effect. So you could either respring it later or respring now. So I'm just going to respring now and show you that it does work. And then I'm going to show you how to go about getting this application from Cydia. So let's go ahead and unlock. And let's try that same mail thing we did before. Okay, let's just do uh, that and that. And there we go. You see it's like the brown and it has all the effects that I put on there. So this is pretty cool, guys. A great way to edit, you know, a uh, great way to, um, you know, add a little spice to your to your already customized iPhone or iPod Touch. You know, this just gives it another little extra touch. Nothing, you know, that you're going to be using daily basis, but it's just something to look at, something cool, something unique that a lot of your friends won't have and uh, you could just show it off to them. So just search alert artist, it's all one word. I believe this is from iHacks repo, just like the, all the other ones I've been doing lately. They, uh, that's probably, that's the biggest, the best repo I'm using right now that I have installed right now. So let's search alert artist. So there you go, you see it right there. Looks like it is a paid app, but this is gonna be how to get it free. So there you go, you have it. It is from iHacks repo. So here's the source iHacksRepo.com right there. That's it guys. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs this video up if you enjoyed it, learned something new from it. And uh, you know, subscribe if you haven't already subscribed and leave me a comment on what you thought about the video and if you're gonna get this or not. Thanks for watching guys. Catch you in the next one. Peace.